Hey guys, Connor here from Gear Reviews, uh, bringing you another video. This week it is the Yeti Rambler Colster temperature test. Now, you may have seen a live stream of this on the weekend, um, but you may not have because it's not really the most exciting thing to watch uh, a little screen have uh, numbers change on it depending on uh, the temperature of the can in the Yeti or the can just sitting out. Um, so it is a completely uh, even playing field. This uh, little electric thermometer has the top probe being in the Yeti and the bottom probe being in the regular can of pop at room temperature. Uh, there's nothing weird going on. I'm going to get the pop right out of the fridge. They're both uh, fresh cans. They should have the both same starting temperature. And after that, it's just going to see whichever one lasts the longest at the coldest temperature. So let's get to it. All right, guys, it was about 430 right now. We're going to start the live stream. Um, and we're gonna get the two cans of pop out of the fridge and we're gonna see how well that these two things do. Alright, so we're gonna put Pepsi 1 in the Yeti, Pepsi 2 over here. We'll screw on the ring to lock it in place. Okay, there we go. Alright, so we're gonna open one can, open the second can, and we're just going to slide the probes in. And now we wait. So as you can tell, they are live readings. Um, both probes should be at the bottom of the can and they can't really move anywhere. Um, so the temperature reading is going to change. I will kind of check back for this video every so often. Um, but for the live stream sake, it's basically just going to be sitting there uh, for however long this takes and uh, I guess we'll see on the other side of uh, how well this actually works and how cold things stay. So uh, enjoy. Alright, hey guys, we're checking in here at around 15 minutes since the start of the live stream. We already have a 3 degrees difference on the thermometer uh, showing the Yeti is currently sitting at 3 degrees Celsius and the room temperature Pepsi is sitting at six degrees Celsius. Um, so 15 minutes in, already having that three degree difference. Um, it doesn't sound like a lot, but that really does stand for uh, some quality right there, being that you're only three degrees after staying out for 15 minutes already. And as you may have saw at the start of the live streamer video, it was at around two degrees that these cans came out of the fridge at. So already showing that not much uh, warming has happened to the Yeti, whereas the room temperature can is already up around four degrees. So stay tuned and uh, we'll check back in later to see how we're doing. All right, so now we're at the half an hour mark. Um, as you can see on the clock, it's it's been around half an hour. Um, we are now at four and eight. Um, so that means the Yeti has gone up approximately two degrees since we've started this test and the um, regular can of pop sitting in uh, room temperature has gone up approximately six degrees. So that means we're looking at a one to three ratio, I guess. Uh, for every degree the Yeti gains, the uh, regular can of pop will gain three. Um, so I mean, that's quite impressive to see on uh, it, but I mean, I guess sort of the trend that we're seeing is that Yeti products work really well, so you're getting that value you're paying for but we will check back in in about 15 to 30 minutes and see where we're at then. All right, so checking in at about the hour mark. Right now have the Yeti Rambler at six degrees starting from two. Um, and then the regular room temperature can of pop is sitting at 12 degrees, also starting at two. So we've seen a 10, 10 degree increase on the uh, can of pop that's just sitting out, uh, you know, experiencing the room temperature. And then we have a four degrees increase for the Yeti Colster. So after an hour, I mean, this is pretty shocking uh, for me that it's still so low. I mean, if you're outdoors at the cottage, I could easily see it being, uh, the can being finished in probably 15 to a half an hour. And then also depending on if, you know, you're doing some yard work or if, um, you know, maybe you're on a canoe ride or something, I could see something being uh, open for more than 30 minutes, maybe even more than an hour. So uh, we'll keep going with the live stream 
and uh, I'll check in again in about another 15 to 30 minutes as well just to see where we're at. All right, we are checking in now at an hour and a half. So we currently have a eight degrees for the Yeti Rambler uh, pop can going up six degrees and we have 15 degrees for the room temperature pop can. That means it's gone up 13 degrees. So I think an hour and a half is a pretty reasonable amount of time uh, to have a pop can open and seeing as the Yeti's only gone up six degrees, that's pretty great because that still should be cold enough to, uh, you know, enjoy the drink. All right, so we're here at about two hours check-in. So right now, as you can see, we got the Yeti again sitting pretty at nine degrees Celsius. So again, that's, that's only really a seven degree increase. Whereas if we're looking over here at the um, room temperature can of pop, it is at 17 degrees Celsius. So that's again, that's 15 degree increase over two hours. So, um, and look at that, we've just got the um, Yeti to come to 10 at two hours or just past two hours. So I'm still really amazed by this. I feel like 10 degrees Celsius is still a decent temperature for drinking at. And I mean, it's been two hours, so I'd really say the most important part was in that first hour where, um, you know, that's when you're probably gonna be drinking the majority of your drink, or that's when the majority of the time when it might sit there without you drinking it. Say you forgot or you were uh, on a quad or something, you never know. But still really impressive. So I'll keep this uh, going and we'll just uh, see how long it takes to maybe get uh, to around the same temperature as there is a seven degree difference right now and uh, we'll keep checking in. So, uh, you know, big props to the Yeti so far and let's see what else happens. All right, guys, here we are. It's about uh, a minute or two past seven o'clock uh, my time. We uh, have been going for two and a half hours here. The Yeti has just passed 11 degrees Celsius and the room temperature can has just sat at 18. Um, so I think two and a half hours is a pretty fair assessment to go with here. Um, you know, I really don't think that most people are going to be leaving their cans out longer than this. Um, I think this is probably a good range. Like if you are leaving it out this long, that's why you have one of these. Um, it's going to keep it colder clearly. Um, over two and a half hours, it only went up nine degrees. So, you know, that's a degree or two every half an hour, which is not really that much when you think about it as compared to over here that went up 16 degrees in that same two and a half hours the exact same conditions just sat here for the whole time how well yeti makes their products i guess um i can't really say much other than that really really impressed um just like the ice in the yeti tundra you know this is sort of why things like this exist um and as i said the temperature was 18 it's gone up to 19 and 17. But you know, this this is just a testament to how well uh, Yeti makes their products and how um, you know, and just how high of a quality they're held to. So you know, really impressed. Going to give it a huge thumbs up. Uh, the Yeti Rambler Colster is clearly um, an item that should be in most people's uh, cupboards or cabinets or uh, camping equipment, anything like that. If they drink. Um, you know things out of cans at any time because it's just phenomenal that uh, you know after two and a half hours it only went up nine degrees and it's still quite cold to the touch um, and let, maybe let's just uh, put this back in and uh, as you can just see it's already going back down um, it is really just that cold in this little you know thermos for um, a can so um, really great job. Um, super impressed by Yeti and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I know the live stream was not very popular but I had to do it anyways just to show that I wasn't cheating or anything so I thought hey why not let's post a live stream but um, I hope you guys enjoyed this test video. Look out for some more videos in the future and uh, we'll see you guys later.